Hey guys, what's up? Thank you so much for watching. Today's video is going to be an undecorated with me and we are going to be taking down my Christmas tree. I will say that this is probably the earliest I've ever taken it down. Um, I feel like in the past it's always just been out of pure laziness and procrastination, but not this year. We are going to start the year off right. I also wanted to share with you guys some cute and affordable storage solutions that I also picked up as well. So no more tangled lights or broken ornaments. I got you covered. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure Sure to give it a thumbs up hit the subscribe button down below and let's jump right into it i've got that feeling rushing through my body i know that so these are the different holiday storage items that I picked up and I will have everything linked down in the description bar down below. This one is going to be for all of the ornaments and it does hold 112 ornaments. There was a smaller one so I will also have that link down in the description bar as well. And this is going to be the thing to hold all of your crafts, your wrapping paper, ribbon, all of that stuff because I know it can be a huge mess. And then this, I'm hoping our tree will fit in it because lately we've been putting the tree in the big box it came in. So I'm hoping that this will be a lot easy to store it. And then the last is going to be lights because who wants to open a bunch of jumbled lights for the next holiday season? So this is the stuff that I'm going to be using. And yeah, let's get started. I bet you think that I should calm down. The tree lighting storage says it will fit 500 lights, but I was definitely able to fit way more. On each cardboard insert, I was able to fit two light strings with no problem at all. I stored 600 lights and still had about three inserts left to use. Before I'm too invested, I should probably ask you, ask you all my questions, get to know you better. But can you be trusted? Will you take me for granted? And will you let me down? Before I'm too invested, you should take it easy. For the Christmas ornaments, there were inserts that needed to be put together, and I definitely struggled trying to get the first piece up, but I eventually got it. There are definitely pros and cons to this storage solution. I love the fact that it's so compact and I was able to fit most of the ornaments inside. 
However, I wasn't able to store any of our larger ornaments, so if you have any oversized ornaments which are definitely on trend, this storage solution will not work for you. You rattled my cage without warning, kept it up right till the morning, a new kind of ecstasy. You found a different side of me, the one I'd like to be, a different side of me, yeah. Like someone pretty need a different side of me, yeah. down till we take flight it's how you make me feel yeah yeah let's call it sick and be lazy i'm all for doing what's crazy cause you make it real yeah It was definitely time to get all of our gift wrapping items organized. We were using one of those plastic under the bed bins that really didn't work for us anymore and was more of a hassle bringing it up and down the stairs. So this compact storage solution has made life easier. The last thing left to be packed up is our tree and the storage bag was huge. I had more than enough room and could even have purchased a smaller one but I did love how I was able to store the base as well as the tree skirt. I definitely could have added in any Christmas wreaths in there as well. to be a different side of me yeah I try, written down the words to say it is time i've been waiting five days to explain how you make me feel inside baby got it all figured out wanna do this right there's no doubt in my mind baby It is so crazy how bare our family room looks without the tree up, but now it gave us extra room to lay out all of Riley's toys, and I was even able to put her play mat out again, which she is a huge fan of.
thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed today's video and it gave you the motivation to start tackling all of your holiday decor are you somebody who likes to take everything down right after the new year's or do you like to hold on to the christmas holiday just a little bit longer let me know in the comment section down below i would love to connect with you guys there give this video a thumbs up hit the red subscribe button if you haven't done so already and i'll catch you guys in my next video bye